Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Going Medieval. So today I wanted to finish the gardening and we'll see if we can't get the barley uh, grown, well started, they're still working on it and then there's the trees over here and there's a few other things that I wanted to start working on and that's hopefully getting some of these trees cut down because we need a lot of these things, and some of these are already fully grown, so it's probably best to um, get somebody... Oh yeah, and then we had some building projects, didn't we? We had that, that building project uh, underway, so we'll probably have to get some more resources for that. And there's these building projects going on. So there's a few things going on, and hopefully Sylvester will be able to... Um, harvest some of these trees um some of the stuff down here isn't really required but we'll see if we can't just cancel some of these tasks these will eventually die anyways because they're um where the water will be and i'm going to be doing that this weekend so backing up the entire game and save and all that stuff Actually, yeah, we need that one to be cut. Okay, so there's that. Those actually should be cut as well. Let's see if we can't find any other things that have marked for cutting. Those are ready for being cut. Let's see here. I think that's about it. another dead tree here though and another one so we'll tell them to chop those ones down I tried to cut down the dead trees because we get more sticks from them so like if we were to look at that we get 25 sticks but if we look at that oh actually we get less huh that's interesting only five less though so not a huge deal of difference in wood but we have um our tree farm that we have so we, we get pretty, pretty good amount all right so that explains why we're not getting that many <laughs> uh, sticks I thought we got more from dead trees but apparently I was wrong all right so we'll tell them to chop that down we'll clear out actually I'll leave those things I think that'll be fine it's just a few things but
right then. So currently I am just coming over here to hunt some wolves and I'm starting to tame up some, uh, what do you call it? Some deer. Okay, that one missed. Ah. Okay, we'll have to go over here. Hopefully get them. There's a few over on this side. I was hoping to get a corner them off this direction. Oh, hold on a second. We can't do that. Okay. Um, go that way, I guess. Uh, yeah, there's a uh, one or two over on this side. So I have a deer over here that I'm trying to tame up. And I wanted to make sure that it's safe from the wolves, so okay, we'll try to take on that little one first. Okay, so I got that one done. Um, we still have a few other ones that we need to take care of. Uh, there is that one over there. I thought there was two over here. Uh, they're going that way, that's why. There's a whole bunch over here, so we'll, we'll do that one, and then um, I'll tell this one to Urgent Hall.
All right, so I started expanding our um, cold storage. So we just need some people to come in here and build some stuff. And I'm going to copy the shelves, the settings from these ones. And then I'm going to go ahead and just select all these over here and in the other ones. And then I'll set the settings for these to be the same as the food shelves. That way uh, we can make sure that we have enough food storage for pretty much everything. Um, beeswax will be in this spot here. So we can call that bees or wax pile. And this one is uh, tallow pile, so fat basically. And then that will open up this one for um, rough wine. Age, well, we have some uh, aged fine wine in here as well. We can trade that. Okay, I'm not sure why I have these two shelves here. Uh, we will remove those. Don't really need them. I think they were meant for medicine, but we just use herbs and tallow, so... Um, we can remove those and put them in storage for when we need them. And... Once those are removed, we can expand it for the wine. It's just a little bit closer to the uh, dining area, so... Makes sense to have the wine closest there. And uh, what else have I done? Uh, taming's going well for those deer. Uh, I did hunt all the um, f the wolves, so we're at thirty three percent for that one. There's only been like two attempts uh, for taming, so and then the other one is at 32 percent so not too far off um both successful i'm just keeping my eye open for any wolves uh fox population is going up as well so that's good and so far it looks pretty secure i'm not seeing any uh wolves at the moment so it should be good for a little bit longer until they one spawns on the map uh, we don't have enough trees to plant there, and they haven't really chopped down anything over here. Uh, I just realized that um, Sylvester was still sleeping, so... I
Alright, so we got uh, quite a bit of stuff done today. I got a little bit more mined out here. Uh, we started taming a couple deers. That way we have a steady supply of deer uh, pelts and then we might be able to start working on some other things for that. Uh, we um, harvested a couple uh, cows. Looks like we have a couple new ones in. That one is 10 days old, and so is, well, that one's 9 days old, so a couple new cows, and our sheep and goat population is doing good. We're going to need to build a new barn, hopefully next week, if everything goes well, and over the weekend, what I'm going to do is I'm going to flood this um, little part right here, and I'm going to flood that part, and that way we can still work on the um, mining out this clay and stuff. Uh, as we progress to get um, all this mined out, we're probably going to have to remine that part out and uh, figure out a support system for... Actually, you know what? We could probably leave that because then we can support it on the other side when, when while we dig under it. I think that would probably be the best uh, thing to do, honestly. So, And we worked on a lot of gardening, so we got... Um, what do you call it? These all um, planted. We got that planted. These planted. All those planted. They accidentally planted the carrots for the seeds again, but that's okay. Um, it shouldn't take too long. Only we should have enough time to harvest it. So that's uh, all good. And barley's ready. So uh, only thing left really to do is basically go ahead and flood that and then we can start focusing on some more building projects. But outside of that, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.